Hello everyone, welcome to Europa Universalis 4. I have been waiting so long for this game, like since 3 came out. I mean, this is an amazing game, this is going to be my favorite game of this year. And, you know, it's just, this game, ah. By the way, I have all DLC except for this one, I don't know what that is, I'm not even going to buy it. National Mo Monument, that seemed pretty useless. Well, we could play the tutorials, but I already have played a little bit of this game, so I will be okay, I think, for the beginning, except for the colonizing, but that will be fine. Uh, I will do those on my own time. For now, let's just see. Options uh, should be good, actually. Single player. Okay, historical start. Rise of the Ottomans, the fall of Byzantium, a new world. Uh, world, blah, blah, 80 years of war, blah, blah, blah. 80 years of war, not 80 years. Ago. Let's pick the first one on 11 November. So we can play as any nation we want, but let's pick nothing too hard for now. What the hell is going on with traffic? I hope that doesn't pick up too loud. Uh, no lucky nations. Normal should be good. No bonuses. So, as the Ottomans, Castile, France, England, Austria, Sweden, Portugal, Muscovy, Venice or Poland. I was thinking Poland or Muscovy. Because Muscovy gave us a little bit of a chance to look at colonizing early on. But Poland is also pretty decent. You know, you're here in the middle of... Europe doing your thing. Bohemia is also a possibility, by the way. Hmm. I don't want to play as England. They are already at war with France and... I don't want to do that. Uh, maybe Scotland. But that's a little bit hard to begin with, isn't it? Aragon. Uh, Shen is already doing that. Castile. That just seems a little bit too easy, you know. Portugal. What the hell is Portugal going to do? Oh! Oh, they have already a thingy down there. Well, not yet. Now, Muscovy, that means I have other tech, and I really would like to start with Westernized tech, because then I don't have to worry about that just in the beginning. So, mm, Naples. But Naples is a facile. Friends, the guts play as Burgundy. Eh, that's maybe not so bad, but I wanted to pick one of these. Uh, Poland. Vessel Moldavia. And Mazovia. Okay, that seemed decent. No, Muscovy, what? Uh, Pskov? Pskov? I don't know how to say that. Is a vessel? Those are those guys. Uh, Yaroslav and diver this may be a pretty decent start but i just don't know yet uh, you know what let's go hungary is all oh my god so many options i just don't know what to do uh, castile is just too easy burgundy uh, burgundy doesn't really speak to me Poland also not. Let's just do it. Let's just go for Muski. I'm just going to press this play button. Watch. I did it! Oh, internalizing game. I may have to skip. Oh, we are already here. It was like F9. Okay. Let's do this. Map mode. Uh, 15,000 man army. Nice. I have to set my mes messages. I will be right back. Okay, so I have done some message chat settings. Settings? Settings. So let's take a look at our country. Our ruler is eh, bad. Military skill 2, diplomatic 1. Administrative 3. That's not good. Uh, advisors. Inflation. Administration. Technology. 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 Cost. My god. 
It's not my day to speak English. Utter relations over time. No, that's useful. But how much money do I make? Uh, you have what I do. There's an easy... Plus 5, is that correct? Yes. Plus 5.76. Uh, let's go to that. Rivals. Da -da -da. Okay. Let's just select a mission. Form an alliance with Ryzen. Eh. Conquer Torzok? Where is Torzok? There it is. That may be a good thing to do first. Moscow doesn't have too much troops normally in the beginning. They shouldn't have. Should they? Let's just do that. I will gain 5 prestige, but it gives me a Cossus Bella. Okay. Spew, blah blah. It's not important. Tartar Patriots. Okay. Where are they? Uh. Kaziom. Kaziomov? Kaziomov. This is it. Uh. Okay. That's going to be a problem. Is there anything else in my country? It is not my culture. Or. Yeah. That's a little bit of an issue. Uh. Trade. Let's take a look at that now. Well. Of course. But. I don't have one. So it doesn't really matter. Just. 20. Well, actually it does. It's pretty decent, but... I know this is only 2.2. 2.7. 1.6. Ah, this is better. Just send it in. Okay. Seem decent. Technology cost 444. That's decent. Eastern technology cost to westernize. To be able to westernize, we need to have neighbors that belong to the western technology group. Westernization will reduce our stability to minus 3, reset our monarch, monarch points to minus 100 and also change our technology group to Western. That's not too bad. Uh, handle them. Nah. It's not really needed. 0.6% Our army, where is it? Here it is It has no leader, can I pick one? Yes, is he my... No he is not, is he? I also... Oh, I have a pretty decent air So that's the thing uh, Let's pick you Diplomacy Lines options. Da, da, da. I have to stop that at I. It's annoying. It's even annoying for me. Uh, diplomatic annex vessel. Okay. If I declare war. No. Well, first I have to set them as a vessel. Uh, what do I say? As a vessel. Uh, as a rival. Uh, Novgorod, yes. Novgorod. Probably Lithuania. But it will cost me 10 diplomatic points, so I am not going to pick the rest just yet. Uh, military advisor. 5 points. I can't pay for anyone at this point. They're all too expensive. So that's a little bit of an issue. Trade seems fine. Technology. Yes. Let's just speed up by two. Cool. Hmm. I need allies. What about Sweden? Diplomacy. Uh, alliance. Of they don't like us. 
So doesn't Lithuania. I should improve relations with Lithuania. Then again also with Sweden. And I need allies. Teutonics. Does anyone like me? That's a point. If you're my country. Opinion. Yaroslav. Bosnia. Byzantium. Nobody strong likes me. Hmm. Well. That means no alliances for me. Okay, so. One of my men. Go. No, no, no. Relations. Improved relations with Sweden. And then I will use the other one. Remove up by the way. Diplomatic. Declare war. To take. Torzok. No. Seems fine. Let's do this. And let's start the game. Yep. Here it goes. At three speeds. Accepted military alliances. I will turn that to a pop-up and all. No, I have you free. Another diplomat free. They are at war, yes, they are at war with Novgorod, so are they. Okay, seems fine. Well, I want to vassalize them at some point. I really have to deal with this province. Uh, let's close this down. Hmm. Missionary, what will it cost me? You will have a monthly progress of 0.0%. .0%. Okay, so I first have to change the culture. Eh, uh, what will it cost me? Why can't I do that? So I first have to send the missionary right there. Eh, uh, do I want to though? I want to, but do I want right now? I also don't have a core. Base cost 80. Oh, this, that is already one of ours. Okay, I was looking at this and I thought, you know, that's going to be course, but no it isn't. Kazan has currently the most power in Kazan. Okay. Oh, that's trading. Okay, that's fine. So... Do I want to though? I want to. I need to do that. Let's send one. Okay. No, I should go deal with this army first. So, I'm going to do that. Just to get rid of it. Seven. That's a lot of casualties. What's are all these buttons? Attach to first army of the... Okay. Let, let's just go take them out before we lose everyone. I have to do something about this sound. Game options. Audio. Uh, like that. Okay, I'm going to defeat them, that's good. Now also... It's all wasteland, isn't it? Yes, it is. For that we need to defeat... Per what religion are they? Orthodox. Oh, that's good. Okay. I also should... Like, uh, see what my decision is. Form Russia. That's probably the most important one. 
uh, we need to own Moscow and Novgorod. Okay? Own Stiver, have a Korin Tiver. Own Yaroslav, have Korin Yaroslav.